Good morning. It is now time for another life lesson from God's Word. This morning we'll continue our study in the book of James, verses 13 through 17. Let's go ahead and read them again. Come now you who say, today or tomorrow we will go to such and such a city. Spend a year there, buy and sell and make a profit. Whereas you do not know what will happen tomorrow. For what is your life? It is even a vapor that appears for a little time and then vanishes away. Instead, you ought to say, if the Lord wills, we will live, shall live and do this or that. But now you boast in your arrogance. All such boasting is evil. Therefore, to him who knows to do good and does not do it, to him it is sin. What I want us to look at is verse 14. Verse 14 tells us that life doesn't last forever. Life on this earth doesn't last forever. Uh, when I think about this idea of a vapor that appears for a little time, uh, short time and, and goes away, uh, there's a couple things that hit my mind. Early in the morning when the dew has settled on tin roofs or on the trees or even actually on, on, you know, just on the rooftops and the sun comes up and starts warming it up, we have a, a mist, a vapor, a foggy-like substance that rises off the, the rooftops. Uh, we live in, in the Smoky Mountains, the same idea, the fog lifting out of the mountains. Uh, it's only there for a short time. It's not there for very long at all. You only, can only see it when the sun comes up and starts warming the earth. Another example, if you've not seen that, would be like uh, the steam that comes off coffee in the morning. When you, you know, perk a pot of coffee, we have a lot of steam coming out of it. You can tell it's, it's hot. Uh, you have a lot of water vapor. But it doesn't last forever. It goes away. See, our life on this earth is temporary. It's not for eternity. It will not last forever. As much money as we can throw at, at, at healing of diseases and to, to keep on our health what it ought to be, at some point in time, that money will fail. Our health will fail. And we will pass from this life and enter into eternity. And so as we live our lives today, I want to encourage us to consider the life after this life. This life is temporary, but the life after this one is over is eternal. And so let's live in such a way that brings honor to God in this life so we can praise Him in the next one. Let us pray together. Uh, dear Lord, Heavenly Father, again, we're grateful for this day. Father, we're humbled. We're humbled knowing that the life that we have is temporary. It will not last forever. The life on this earth one day will cease. And it doesn't matter how many medical advancements we have. We will one day pass from this life and enter into eternity. Father, we pray that you'll help us to uh, become more the type of people we need to be to, to be prepared for that eternal life that we have in Jesus. Father, we pray in all things that we may honor you and we anticipate your return some sweet day. We love you and pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. We truly hope that we've been a blessing this morning. If we can help you in any way with your walk with the Lord, please let us know. Feel free to contact us. We'd be glad to hear from you. Come again tomorrow for another life lesson from God's Word.